Welcome back. <coughs> Excuse me. Welcome back, guys. We are continuing on with these Hexarchy multiplayer matches. And <laughs> I was feeling France again. Yay, we've got France. So I've been messing about in skirmish mode. And I've been playing without getting the Berserker and Statue of Zeus. Now, in a minute, where are we? We are more, more to the left, but pretty central. I'm going to go here. Hmm. Not sure if that was a good decision. So what I'm going to do is start off with the library and then we're going to try and get a forge and not bother going down the mysticism paganism route. So it does mean that we'll have to use barracks to start mobilized but most of the time I will be recruiting from barracks so it shouldn't really make any difference but this is not not good that there's no land here so we want the woodworking I think I might even start with a scout, just so I can actually see where I'm going. Well, that's unfortunate. I'm going to need to scrap one more thing. Oh, warrior. That'll do. So, if I scrap two more things, yeah, they'll do. And I can get a scout out as well. Well, I didn't see much there. So, clearly, all of this area is just sea. So I would have been much better off starting here. But, we didn't know. Now we know. So, I don't think I'm going to bother with the Colosseum, because I'm going to be at one population for basically the entire game. That's once we get the Imperial Guard, obviously. Come on. Come on. So I'm going to burn the mysticism. I might live to regret that decision. Okay, so we've found we found the Arabs and they've already built uh, it's only a settler an archer and a settler so we could get an imperial guard unit out if we scrap one more thing. 
Very nice. Okay, it's not the fastest. Turn four. I quite often get it out on turn three. And he's not starting mobilised. And he's not starting in a barrack, so... Yeah. Not sure if this is worth it, to be honest. Just wanted to do that so I could put the strength on him. Ideally, we would take in a minute one, two, three. Yeah, so we we want a, a barracks on here. Yeah, he's built another archer, I think. Oh no, he's built a scout. Okay. Right. Well... Build the barracks. We want the military dictatorship and the conscription. We've got the science for this now. So I'm gonna take the conquistador. We've got the imperial guard. We can now use a conscript or conscription. Give him conquistador. Come on. Come on. And strength. Now, not starting with Berserker. We might not take this. It all depends if he's going to move his scout out. Or build another unit. Because I'm not sure if he built this scout this turn or last turn. Oh, nice. That worked out well. Because the Imperial Guard unit that's in Paris is going to... Oh, damn it. That didn't work out well, though. That's bloody frustrating, that is. I hate it when they go first. It's, it's just not, it's not fair. <laughs> Why? Is there any point in doing that? Or shall I just take it? So does that mean he's going to go first every single turn now? Because that's what usually happens. If I would have gone first, I would have taken Mecha there. It's, uh, yeah, it's really frustrating. And I didn't get the charge off because I didn't move because he moved right up to me. Yeah, it's the one thing that I really don't like about this game. And I'm not really sure how they go about fixing that. Well, I could get... Oh, in a minute. Yeah. If I redraw... These are selling for four. Or oh, I could buy the Arc to Triumph. Might even be worth doing that. I'll slow down the expansion a little bit.
Right, yeah, that'll do. So it slows down the expansion a bit, but it means that I'm guaranteed to have the Arc de Triomphe. So this turn we're going to find out if he goes first or not. If he does, it'll completely screw us over. Right, so we want... Oh, it would have been nice if we'd had this or this tile. Don't particularly want to build a barracks here, but we're going to, we're going to do it anyway. Mountains there and forest. Oh, the forest isn't going to make any difference, but the mountains there. Oh, that's a nasty choke, that is. Maybe I'm better off. Bring him out to this direction and then I might come round here instead. Just gonna buy these luxuries. One to level up Paris. Two to do that. I think I'm actually gonna get this food as well so I can level up Paris again. And if I put it in again, it'll level up again at the end of this turn. Okay, so let's see if he brings an archer here and these two don't move. Well, this one would move to there and then kill the archer, but, or whatever he puts there. He's just lagging it. But he did move first, so he had the opportunity to prevent me from charging there. Okay, so if we put the two food in here, I'll level that up. Then let's move him to there, the other one to here. Then let's build a barracks here. And conscription in Medina will do. Followed by Imperial Guard here. And then what we can do... Get the conscription again. Get another Imperial Guard unit out here. And I can even give him Strength and Conquistador. My input in this here is not good. Right, so let's go. Oh, Beijing isn't exactly easy to take either. But let's go after Beijing. Okay, I think that is good enough. Who have we not moved? Oh, we haven't moved with them.
well. He's looking good. We've got five Imperial Guard units out and they're not starving. See if we can work our way round. Want to not get stuck in a one-tile choke here, so I'm going to approach from two different directions. I should be able to build a barracks. Oh no, you obviously need to link up the territory. That's a shame. So I'm going to build a barracks here. Use a conscription. Sell this. I want the conscription again. There it is. So we can actually put that in Paris. Oh, you can only do it once per turn. Okay. In fact, if I went to there, that should link up. Ah, we seem to be one short. So I, I'm, I'm thinking conscription uses one industry, even though it doesn't say it does, because I had two industry just. He's got an archer in here, so this scout isn't going to live. Oh, moving him to there was pointless because I didn't put the um, conquistador on him. Oh well. Yeah, not having charge is uh, proving to be, not charge, sorry, Berserker, a bit of a delay on us. I mean, we're going to win, I would have thought, but it's definitely not quick. Going for the Arc de Triomphe and not going for the Berserker has probably slowed us down significantly. So it all depends if China go before me now, whether I take this city or not. I might actually just go up here. I wonder where I can build... Oh, I can build a barracks here now. I wonder why I couldn't have built them there before. I've been confused about that in the past. I don't understand. Oh, did I not have food in the closest... Right, I think that is everything. 
we need to sell this stuff so our people don't starve to death. Okay. So it's potentially a turn 11 victory, but it's not the quickest. Has this, has this stopped me from going through even though it's only a bloody catapult? Or have they not moved yet? <laughs> I don't think, I don't think they've moved yet. There we go. <laughs> I thought that catapult stopped me going through for a second then. But yeah, it looks like we've taken every single city by turn 11. I have done it by turn 6 before, so... It was definitely not the fastest, but it probably was the safest. I don't know. I'm not sure. It's hard to really say. But yeah, France are, are completely broken OP. But I think I could probably just forget about the Arc de Triomphe. Maybe forget about the forge, because I don't usually go for the forge. The reason that I go for the forge, or have done in this game, is because you have enough industry then to be able to put a barracks down and to put conquistador and strength on the new unit that you recruit. But it does slow you down. I just think it's a a more reliable approach, even though it's not the quickest. But yeah, France, ridiculous. France are ridiculous. <laughs> I just love using them. <laughs> oh dear. I like the Greeks as well. They're fun. But they do stall a little bit at the end game. But yeah, I think I might use the Greeks again next game. So anyway, hope you enjoyed it. Cheers for watching. Take care. I'll see you soon.